Can you see everything you've got going on at a glance? Of course not. But then again, in a very real sense, yes you can. Let's take a look at how by using Canboard's dashboard views. The whole reason to use Kanban boards, at least for me, is to be able to dump the contents of my brain somewhere so I can focus on one thing at a time. If that same system showed me all of that at once, it would be utterly useless, right? So how can we use this tool so it only shows me the things that I need to see? With Camboard, we filter out all of our future plans and anxiety to focus only on the things that can be picked up and worked on immediately. This allows us to sit down in front of the board and easily determine the answer to the question that we should be asking ourselves, what's best next? The first thing that pops to my mind when we talk about limiting what's in front of my face is, is filtering. So the first thing I'm going to go to is, is setting up custom filters for myself. Uh, every board is going to have this in the configuration of the project itself. So say for instance, I wanted to add a custom filter that took a look at all the uncomplexitized tasks. That would be all the tasks whose status was open, but whose complexity was zero. By adding that, I can now see in the board a default filter called uncomplexitized that will highlight exactly the tasks that I need to complexitize so we can get back to our regularly scheduled prioritization. Another noteworthy way to get to my relevant tasks faster is to bookmark a particular search. For instance, this would be all of my assigned tasks. Now we can see that the filter here is actually reflected in the URL parameters in the browser. This means I can simply bookmark this as my default board view and come here with this filter applied every single time. This also works in the dashboard, especially for instance, if I wanted to sort by the swim lane, and I'm actually gonna select that twice so I can sort it from top to bottom as it's shown in my board, and I can save this as my default dashboard. Lastly, since I want this dashboard to be a snapshot of the tasks that I can pick up and work on at any time, I want these to be only the ones that are relevant to me immediately. To do this, I filter out different columns based on the individual projects. For instance, in this project, we have our in progress column visible on the dashboard. To additionally add the review column, I would edit it and uncheck the hide tasks option. This now gives me all of the relevant tasks on my dashboard without any other additional clutter. Camboard is a powerful tool that can minimize the distractions in your workflow quickly and efficiently, leaving you with no doubt as to what to be spending your time on. If you have any questions about Camboard dashboard views, let us know by posting to us in the subreddit or contacting us through the website. And if you're wanting to try out Camboard for yourself, let us know by signing up for an instance at rcompose.com today.